Hey YouTube, it's me, Lucky Charm 7 again. Um, I'm just coming to show y'all this uh, look that I came up with. It is um, white with um, a frost off the page MAC and golden orange, a little bit of gray, red, and naked for my highlight. Um, I really just kind of came up with it, it came off my hoodie. Got my Hollister hoodie, California. Um, not from California, but I like the hoodie. My girlfriend bought it for me. Um, so, it's really gross and nasty outside. So, I kind of wanted to come up with a look that's a little bit brighter. So, when I go to work, I'm not like, eh, feeling like trash while I'm at work. But, anyway, really simple, really easy, kind of quick. Um, that's it. So, if you want to learn how to do this look, keep watching. Here it is. Okay, so um, I've already primed my eye with actually e.l.f. Eyelid Primer, the liquid one. So I'm going to take my NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk and just put that on my ring finger. And put it close to the lash line. Kind of like that. And then as you start to run out of product on your finger, you can blend it up. So it looks like that. And we're done. <laughs> JK, JK. Okay, so, um, next. Ugh, I've got to stop dropping stuff. What is going on? But I'm going to take my little smudger brush that I got from Target Studio Tools. I'm going to go in with the white. It's just this elf duo that I have. It doesn't have a name. So, forgive me. But I'm going to go in with the white. Bring it on the inner corner and drag it slightly under the lash line. So, inner corner, lash line. Definitely not in your eyeball like I just did, but that's fine. It's fine. Okay, next we're going to go in with Max Off the Page and a regular eyeshadow brush. So, this is Max Off the Page. A really pretty orange frost. Let's not talk about orange. Love that color. Anyway, so I'm going to put that on the inner two-thirds of the eye. Now, the thing with the frost is a lot of people want, like, a huge bright color payoff with it. You can get a bright color payoff um, as far as, like, it showing up, but it's not going to look as bright and out there as a matte because it's a frost, and it's going to give you a frosted look. So just keep that in mind when you're using shadows, like, off the page. Now I'm going to go in with a matte orange. Well, it's got a little bit of shimmer to it. I don't know. But it doesn't, it doesn't have a whole lot of shimmer. It's Golden Orange by NYX. With NYX, with this one, you kind of have to dig your brush in a little bit. But that's going to go on the outer two-thirds of the eye. And you just kind of want to blend it. And just put that right there. Okay. Uh -oh. Now I'm going to take my 120 palette, the side with all the pinks, purples, grays, and blacks. And I'm going to take my um, e.l.f. contour. Okay, sorry about the interruption with that. Okay, it stopped recording in the middle of the recording and yes, so I'm going to start over. But, um, so we're taking this gray with our e.l.f. stiff contour brush. I already started kind of doing it, sorry. But, okay, so I'm going to go right here with the dark gray okay so it's official my camera hates me it stopped recording in the middle of the recording so yeah I'm gonna just show y'all what I did while I was thinking I was doing something I was definitely not doing but um, I'm just gonna take the red this red in the 120 and I put on my T17 and I just use this to smoke out this black start really light over here I mean really dark over here and as you get lighter go in a little bit okay and then I also use a uh, naked pigment oh 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 uh, mm, mm. there it goes naked pigment by MAC to put under my highlight and since it's a very nude color when you start bleeding it in with that red it makes a really pretty pink highlight so that's it and now I'm gonna get it together and you know make the rest of this video all right thanks guys okay JK totally forgot to tell y'all step before I did all that um, you take your frosted, um, off the page again and re-put it, because with all that blending, 
it's going to get toned down a lot. So this is an important step to keep the brightness of your look. See, it's already coming back. And you can't really see that orange on the outer corner. So you do have to go back and put them back in. And just keep it right underneath that gray. Okay? So, now I'm going to go back and line my lids. And then I'll be right back for real this time. Alright. <laughs> okay, here's a finished look. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that's the finished look um, that's it um, I just used Lash Stiletto to um, do my mascara and I used Hip um, in black the Hip Cream Liner in black to line my lids I kind of went a little heavy on the outer corners just because, I don't know but um, that's it so it's really easy, fun um, that's it so I guess I'll see y'all in a later tutorial. Bye, YouTube.